So we got all the uh, posts marked for the chicken coop and uh, the building should be square off these measurements. So that coop will go over in the center here. Okay, so the project today that we're working on is to get the chicken run built. So these are the logs that we hand peeled and we have uh, set up a perimeter that's about 16 by 16. So we still need to level the posts and everything, but it's coming together pretty good.
Okay, so we got the hardwood cloth, our hardware cloth coming along. We got strips going along. We still have to put some some live edge along the sides to tighten it all up. And we have some for the roof, some for the sides, so and some for the door. Okay, so we have some skirting that we milled and uh, we're just putting in the hardware along the outside edges. So this is two feet, two feet wide and it'll go all the way around the perimeter and then we'll put rocks and dirt on there and backfill. So that's what's next. So a little bit further along here, we have uh, the top chicken wire on and we're getting ready to do the roof next. So one thing that we're struggling with a little bit is just uh, there's an opening here. So we're going to do like a one by six on the other side and then find a way to fasten it in here just for more predator proofing. But so far that was only the, the only downside of the plan. So we'll get we'll get that all fixed and then the roof on and then do the one by sixes around the top and around the middle. mesh roof going on and we probably have about maybe two more layers to go here and uh, it's coming along we still have to do the door we're using a staple gun for sealing some of these seams off so probably not the right way to do it but it's cheap and we have loads of staples We built the coop and then decided we wanted a perch inside. So we're going to try to do this with the top one. See how this works. beam on it. We could probably put a couple of cross beams on that. Yeah, that's them. what I was thinking. Just do. Yeah. And it's, it's not in the way. It's in, in the corner and yeah, you might even be able to put one on the top. Yeah, so we'll just notch one of them and then leg bolt it in for them. That'd be really nice.
a little bit of a rustic perch for them to be on. So we were hoping to get this whole thing done this weekend, but we didn't. Still need to finish the door. We did get the boards milled for uh, the door and we have the hinges and everything. We'll get the door framed out this week. We still have, uh, you know, quite a bit more to do. And then we got to do uh, some beams across the roof to hold the chicken wire down and provide a little bit more structure to it. Today we're just uh, framing up the door for the chicken coop. So had a few tools out here and uh, got the door framed in and ready to go. It just needs some hardware now and then the uh, chicken wire over the front. Okay, so we got the door framed and uh, just because we're framing with logs, we squared it up by putting a two by six on the inside of the door just to mount the hinges properly. Have some overhang that we'll cut off with a grinder on a couple of them. But uh, overall, hey bud, how's it going? Overall, it's pretty much ready to go and now we can open it. So we're just getting ready to put the chicken wire on and one step closer to having chickens in here today. So we got the door on and the hardware. So I still have a solar light that I'm really excited to get up here. It's gonna look pretty cool at night. Also pretty excited about the perch. Dug that in with a little skid steer auger. And the chicks are in there, but they still haven't come out yet. So see if they end up. We got some roof beams on. Uh, one more roof beam and then we've got some trim and some wire just to put across the opening there. And uh, some skirting around the front here. And our custom log run will be good. Looks like we've got two brave ones so far exploring. So that is the end of another weekend working on this. So we've got everything is pretty much buttoned up now. We just need to do a little bit of trimming on the wire. Uh, there's some sag inside so that we still need to uh, staple the mesh to the roof. Um, but we even got the solar light on. So this will give us some light here. And uh, we got all the hardware on 
Um, and then tomorrow I'm gonna run the skid steer just in here because we need to take some material out of there so the door opens a little bit better and we still have to put the skirting down so and then add some dirt over that so I'll have to dig out a little bit of that tomorrow but the chickens are in there and they're not going to be coming back in the RV now so uh, they're still a bit young so we'll have the heat lamp on another good day